time is it? You know what time it is. It's time to hit that subscribe button. You know, just where it's at. Right down there. Right down there. And it's time to find my Instagram. That's Geekly Amanda. G-E-E-K-L-Y Amanda. It's the same on Twitter. Make sure to find me both places. And it's time to get this series review started. Let's talk about season five of the Mahabharat because I watched the whole season. That's what this review was on, but it was a shorter season. It only had eight episodes. So much happened though. So much. We got to get down to the details. So last we saw Dedrona, you know, stormed in when, when the blind king was about to announce, you know, the, the, the prince that was gonna uh, be crowned to be the next king and everything, the crown prince. And he came bursting in and he was like, oh no, they got to repay me. And he wanted them to go and put him to test, but go capture the, the Drupad. I know that's the Drupadi's father. I know that's who that is. And they wanted to go do that. So they were like, all right, we got to go do this. That's what well, we got to repay our, our teacher and everything and go do that. Well, of course, you know, Pandav, the Pandavas, they always got the good heart. And, and especially that older brother, he always thinks the best of people. He does. And he thinks they're going to go fight together. Well, you know that it wasn't going to happen. You know they wasn't at the Pandavas and the, the Kuravaz or Kuravaz. Is that how you say that? Kuravaz. They want nothing to do with that. They're like, oh, no, we're going to have. They think they can take them with their hundred sons. <laughs> That's what they, they think. They're like, only five of you. We can, we can take this. We got a hundred of us. So here they come. You know, going after the Drew Pad. And Drew Pad's ready. He's got he got his little daughter in charge there of the of the uh, of the war, or I guess it's not really a war, just the attack. And that's the girl that was like reincarnated, right? What what was her what's her name? Ambika, or it was one of the three sisters that she's reincarnated, and she had that beef with the with the uh, Bishma. Remember, cause he done ruined her. She was gonna, she was in love with that one guy, and and then he was he they Bishma kind of was you know embarrassed him in front of everything, and he didn't want nothing to do with it. And then she came and told Bishma, "Well, you gonna marry me?" And he was like, "I took an oath, I can't." And then she's like, "Well, I'm be the reason for your death." And then she was reincarnated. This girl, I forgot this girl's name, but she's right there, right there, leading the army. You think she's gonna do something? Well, here comes the Kur Kurvaz. Uh, Kurvaz. Is that, I always think I say it wrong. Kurvaz, and they they got this crazy formation with this army. It's like a circle, and the guys keep moving, making it a maze. I was like, what is going on? Well, she comes in. She, her, and and uh, the, that mean prince. You know that older mean prince. She comes in the contact way, and he hits her one shot. She's down and out. I was like, oh, wow, well, her dad ain't going like that. She's supposed to be leading this army, and he done hit her one time. And I was like, don't you hit a girl. That's what I was thinking. Don't you hit a girl. And she was down. Then here comes Drupadi, and he thinks he's going to do something, right? Or not Drupadi, Drupad. He comes, and, and, he th and he comes on. What did he come on? His elephant, and, and him and him, and that mean prince go head to head. And, and you think the mean prince has got him. But then... Dang it, all these droop heads. He's got four more lookalikes. I was like, how did he get all these guys looking like him? And he's got these lookalikes and he's like, D then they're not sure which one because they're supposed to capture the right one, right? I was like, just capture all five and bring them back to that drona. But oh no, he, they got him confused with all those. And then they didn't know what to do. Well, then they captured the hundred sons. The, they captured all hundred, tied them up. Remember, they were like, well, there should be 105. And that one guy's like, oh, there's only a hundred. And they're like, uh-oh, where's the five? Dun, 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 here comes the Pandavas to save the day. This long clip. I hope it lets me show it all because this is of the Pandavas fight with them, with the Drupad and, and the Drupad's army. Y'all ready to do this? Let's get it started. Go. <laughs> oh, there's Bean. Look at Bean. Bean's like, you ain't got me. You ain't gonna get me. They all got some good fighting though. You know the Pandavas, the five of them together, they... You can't stop them, the five of them together. Look at them. You got the twins with their axe skills. You got Bean with his power. They're breaking through all the barriers. They're breaking through all the maze. I 
I love being here. I do. <laughs> well, you know, our dreams my favorite, but look at him. He's like, let's take him. <laughs> They're taking them out though. And look, there's all the tied up brothers. They're going to rescue them, right? I would just left them tied up. But I shouldn't be that way. I would, I shouldn't be that way. But still, they, was, they wouldn't have helped the, the, the five brothers if it was the other way around. You know that wouldn't happen. There they go, untying them. They ain't appreciative. See, and he even was like, let's, look, he was even like, let's work together. He's too good a heart, him. That one's too good a heart. He always wants to think the best. Kami adalah kurawa. You see, he's got too good of a heart. No, they still fighting. They still gonna fight. They don't even need those hundred brothers to fight. That's the thing. They could have. It could have just been the five of them, and they could have did it. Look, where Arjun and his and his arrow. They see the Drew pad. You saw that? He sees them. He sees them off there. Arjun knows. Arjun always knows. <laughs> that should be a saying. That should be a saying. Arjun always knows. Get him. Look at him. He goes through the fire, didn't he? He like ran through all that. Let's stop our June. And he's doing no whistles with his. Oh, he was doing the horse calls. He was making the horses confused. I was like, look at him. The horse whisper. That's what that brother is. He was the horse whisper. He was making those horse sounds. And the horses were like, what do I do? <laughs> they even got the horses on their side, the pandas. Don't they? He's still running to go get that blue pack. They know. Look at him. He's special. He don't even need to carry arrows. He just pulls out that bow and arrows appear. <laughs> That's our Jew. Look at him. One arrow takes out all the guy. He can't even believe it. Him. Kenny. That Drupad, he can't even believe what he's seeing with the Arjun. And the, didn't he say something like he's got the, the bow of like Indra's weapon or something, right? You can tell he's scared. Oh, and he's gonna do it right. He's gonna do a little. There it is. He's gonna put the fire up. Arjun, Arjun don't care about this. Arjun goes right through that. Remember? He's gonna get that horse. You think that's gonna stop Arjun a little fire? He's even got an arrow to put that fire out. I don't know why he didn't use that. I guess this was more dramatic. He's like, I'm gonna get on this horse right here and run through the fire. Look at him. This is what I was nervous about this part. Cause look at this horse running through the fire. I was like, I hope it don't hurt the horse. I was nervous in this part. I was like, no, I don't want you to hurt the horse. Look at him. His legs gotta be hot. I was so nervous about this horse. That looks that look at Drew Pad's face. He's probably nervous about the horse too. Or <laughs> he's nervous he knows Arjun's coming to get him. That's what it is. See, look at that horse going through that. That 
made me so nervous, y'all. Y'all don't even know that how nervous this made me. And then they're gonna go bow to bow. Bow to bow! I hope he gave that horse some kind of barriers or I was I was so <laughs> here he comes here comes our June Doing his special exit on the horse. Oh, look at him! And then he thinks, "Look, you ain't gonna fill our June with your with your lookalikes. You ain't got because you know why he got Krishna on his side. That's why if you got Krishna on your side, you can't you can't get over on him." Mm -mm. Raja Drupada. Apa kau yakin Pangeran Kuru kalau aku adalah Raja Pancala? See, this when he tries to he tries to confuse him like he confused that mean king. He's like, which one am I? Which one? You think I'm here? You think I'm here? Oh, look, I got five of me. Are you going to catch us all? That's why I understand. I'm like, catch them all then. Catch them all. Look at him. They all coming. Which one? Which one is it? I know. Because <laughs> I already watched it. <coughs> and he thinks he's going to... Watch. Watch out, Arjun! And then there's Krishna's stones. That's the stones that Krishna's sister gave to Arjun from Krishna, remember? And everybody's like, well, what's this for? And she's like, you'll know when the time comes. Just carry it with you and know when the time comes. And then he figures it out. Look, they have the one stone with one. And then the other stones have like other, like the one stone had the one little jewel. That looks like the original, right? And then the other ones had the other jewels. And that, that had them figured out. That's how smart. That's how smart our June is. During the battle, he figures this out. That's the intelligence our June has. That's why I, he's my favorite. That's why he's my favorite so far. He is. He's got the skills. He's got the intelligence. He's got the good looks. Yeah, I said it. <laughs> you know he's good looking. Look at him. And he figures it out too. He didn't play around. He shoots that bow. He shoots that arrow up in the air, and it turns in the. Watch. I know they'll show that part. But he figured out right there. He's like, this is what Krishna was telling me. And it's placed just where they're all standing. Look at him. And that's the original. That's the OG right there, Arjun. That's the OG. Here it is. Here it is. Oh, I love this part. I love this part. <laughs> I mean, I don't like that he murders people. That's I'm not. I'm not for always for murder. That's not why. But just because. Just his intelligence of figuring this out in that droop pad. He was like, what's going on? He should be glad that he figured out just his bow didn't go on him too. But he done lost his lookalikes. <laughs> he did. And droop pad can't believe it. He's like, look, Arjun's like, you want this next? You want this next? Oh, well, I'll tie you up. <laughs> He's in shock. Look at him 
come strutting. He's in shock though. Look at it. He can't believe it. He can't believe that he figured it out. When you got Krishna on your side, of course you're going to figure it out. You can't beat the Krishna. Bukan satu, tapi lima drupada. Ilusimu akan lima permata memang luar biasa yang mulia. Tapi pernahkah kau pikirkan agar mirip denganmu? Mereka semua harus benar-benar mirip dengan dirimu. Supaya penyamaranmu berhasil. And the thing is like, I got my stones. That's the Krishna stones. I would keep those stones forever. <laughs> I would, I would never let go of those stones again. My Arjun, my Arjun looking, looking just as handsome as he wants to be. <laughs> well, what happens after this? What happens after this? They bring their Drew pad back, and those Kravaz, they didn't even stick around. They were they went back to the kingdom with their tail between the legs. The five brothers stuck around for Drona to show up. Did that, and then you find out the story why why the Drona wanted the Drew pad. That about broke my heart. Drona just wanted a friend in Drew pad. He went, and remember, he was like, "Oh, my friend, he became the king over there," and I'm just gonna. Go and tell him hi and see if he can spare some milk because my, my little baby son needs some milk. And that Drew Pad just treated him so badly. I was about to cry. I was like, oh, Droney, you carried that in your heart for this long. That this long that, yeah, oh, my heart broke for him. That Drew Pad is mean. I don't like him. I don't like him at all. He's just mean to do that to his friend. And then they made, then he really got him because he's like, well, you're going to, you're going to uh, pour the milk of my son. Do you know this, this stone with the one that the stone in the forehead and he, you're going to make him the crown prince. But still he's even like, this is how nice Drona is. I was like, you're going to take over the kingdom? No, he's like, I'll still, you can still be the king here and split the kingdom. He, he's even going to give him, share it with him. That's more than that Drupal would have ever done, that mean guy. I don't think that's the right decision because, you know, that Drew Pad still has the, the meanness in his heart. So I don't think he's just going to be like, oh, thank you, friend. No, I think he's he's going to hold a grudge forever with with that meanness in his heart. But that was just too nice a drone. I thought that was. I was like, that's so nice. I don't even know if that was a good decision. <laughs> that's how I felt. The Pandavas come back victorious. The whole place knows. They're like, oh, the Pandavas. Woo, Pandavas. Woo, Pandavas. Blind King don't like that because his sons, they can't just do it. Like, he knows their sons ain't as good as the Pandava boys. He knows that. And he's trying to be, do the right thing. You know, I sometimes I don't always like the Blind King. I don't. I always think he makes bad decisions and he's biased and stuff. But at least on this one, he's like, He's doing what's best for the kingdom. The the mean the mean prince don't want that. Oh, he even threatened him. You could remember he went up to him. It's like you do that, father. I'm gonna rebel against him. I'm gonna get war against him. And and the father's like, don't do this because I have to do this for the kingdom. This is what the king does. Even though it's breaking my heart as a father, he still does the right thing. Pours the milk on on the oldest brother, the oldest Pandava. I always forget his name. It starts with the Y. You're. You're something. And he pours the milk on him. And here comes. Oh, oh, I didn't even talk about this part. Because the mean king has plots against him, right? He goes to Karn. He goes to Karn and was like, I need your help. So I was like, okay, you get, you, Karn's like, you made me king. I owe you this. And he's like, but he wants to sacrifice his righteousness to for the help. I was like, don't do that, Karn. That's. I want to like the Karn. I want to love the Karn. I do. He's one of the, the brothers of the Pandavas, yet he don't know it yet. But he is not making the good decisions. He is not. He don't need to be sacrificing his righteousness for for the mean, ki the mean prince. That ain't the way to go, Karn. Don't do this. And then when they're, you're, then they show up, right? Because then they're pouring the milk on the, they went to crown the, the, the oldest Pandava boy, the, the, the crown prince and they show up and you're like uh-oh here it comes like because right here comes the mean and and Karn's right next to him the mean the beam prince and Karn's right next to his side you're like oh here they're causing some trouble here they come causing some trouble then you got the crazy uncle there with his eye like you know some trouble's gonna be caused when he's got his eye down like that you know that's some trouble gonna be caused and then here comes the mean king's like I we support you 
We will accept you being the crown prince. And that oldest brother, there he is with the too good of heart. He smiled and believed it. He was like, oh, thinking it's going to be all harmony and they all going to be friends now. You know that ain't going to happen. You know that ain't going to happen. Arjun ain't believing it. When they showed up, remember all those brothers came around him. was like, try something. There's Beam with his big old thing. They're like, try something. They ain't believing it. But of course, of course, that the, the crown prince now, the oldest Pandava, he, he, do, he just has too good of a heart. Sometimes I just think, I mean, a good heart I'm always for. But you got to also not be naive. You also got to know how the world works. Not everybody's got a good heart and they don't always have good intentions. That's his downfall. That's his downfall. Like, I love somebody with good heart. He could be a, a righteous leader and all that. And even Krishna knows that. Because at the end of this season, what happened? There was a little Krishna. I was like, oh, there he is giving his little wise words. My Krishna. Oh, I love my Krishna. And then he was like, this is when I enter the Mahabharata. I was like, oh, Krishna's going to stop. They are Christians in the Mahabharata. I can't. This is, this is my favorite part in the whole series right now. <laughs> Krishna is in the Mahabharata. He's coming. He's going to make his presence. We already saw he made his little presence with his sister there and the stones and everything. But he's about to enter. And this is when... This is what I've been looking forward to. <laughs> this is what I'm like, let's go. Let's go, Mahabharat. So that was the end of season five. Season six, I'm be having a, a review of that later this week. And it's another short one, only like six episodes. So that's going to, I haven't started it yet, but that should be a quick little watch. It just gets better and better, doesn't it? It just gets better and better. I can't wait to see what else is in store. Let me know what y'all think. Comments, thumbs, all that. Until next time. Mwah!